So in this video, we'll be taking a look at this rconfig 3.9.6 file upload exploit. So you can see there are two exploits for the same version. And if you go to this arbitrary file upload to RCE, and you can see this is a normal request push request to the lib cred vendors dot cred dot php. So the cred is the operation create read update and delete. So we'll be creating a new file name called file dot php and it contains our php payload. And after uploading, you no need to have a logged in account to execute the commands. You can just normally do a curl without logging in and you get the code execution. Let's go to the second one and here. Now you can see this script was written in Python and it's very not good. Uh, it's like copy pasting this burp suit request and editing this host and the file names etc. So this is uh, somewhat not good because it takes so much time to understand. So let's go and first log in into our account admin and admin and admin. So you can also uh, manually upload the file as well. Go to devices. So there will be an option vendors add vendor option in that you can add the website is slow. So let's go and create the exploit. So URL is this one and the post request to the this cred operation dot php so we are going to send the uh, post request so we need to also send the cookie as well So copy this PHP session ID. So let's say cookies is equals to so this is our session. Now we need to create the forum data. So if you observe the request here the name should be vendor name and the content is some description moving on to the second one that is vendor logo and it should contain file.php and file.php and let's go and create a sample file Now we can open this one, open of rc.php and open this in read binary mode. And the content type is, now you can see image or PNG. That is the second forum and the third form is add add edit id.
so i think we are good to go now request our post of url cookies is equals to cookies and files is equals to files print of r dot sorry r is equals to post and print of r dot text so verify is equals to false so this should skip the ssl okay i don't know whether we uploaded successfully or not so to check that what we can do is we can go to this one call so use the minus k option and now you can see we got the code execution so this is uh, so you can also edit the python script like host is equals to something input or you can also use the command line arguments as well so you can also customize this script as well so this is a a lot cleaner than our uh, python script in the expert db so that's all for this video uh, you can get the if you get the code execution on this r config you can uh, change the router configuration and you can almost 